Hey knights, what is up? And welcome back to the one and only Feed the Beast. That is right, we are back with Feed the Beast, and it has been a while. I'm not gonna lie, we haven't been on Feed the Beast for a little bit, but I am back. And the barn is near enough complete. There is a bit of work to be done on it still. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna pop back in to the base over here. And we are going to repair our tools. That is right. We're gonna grab some selves, some iron. Put it in there and repair our tools. So they're all fixed and ready to go. Now, I need some more iron. Do I have any about? Because I probably don't know my luck. Just check the barrel or the chest down here. We've got tin, no iron. That is not good. Not in there. None in here at all. And we've got copper, blah, blah, blah. We don't have any iron. This is bad news for us. Let's check this chest just in case. One block of quartz. That is not helpful whatsoever. But the main thing is the quarry of a digital mine is back online now doing its thing. So let's run upstairs and grab ourselves some iron. Ooh, bit of lag. You're right, doggos. How are we all doing? I think Ghost is around somewhere. I don't know. He's around somewhere. Let's have a look. We've got diamond in here. And obviously an ingots down below. Perfection. Okay, so we have no iron. Uh, let's check upstairs for more dogs because one may have died unless... Yeah, one's died. Okay, one's died. That's fine. Right, you are the new ghost and we've got your girlfriend and your son. So come on, ghost. Let's go. You coming, buddy? Good boy, there's Ghost. Right, let's go through here, Ghost. Come on. Could grab some iron from over here. Let's have a look. Do we have any iron? We probably don't. Oh, we've got, how much have we got iron ore? Sweet. We might have some copper over here. Copper, copper, copper. There's lots of copper. So that's kind of good. Let's just remove this block. Because that was a dumb move on my part. Okay, we have no more iron. So, let's just sit Ghost down right there. Pop this in the smelt. Actually, no, we do have iron. We've got loads of iron. It's all over here. Right. Let's take a bit of that out. And we're going to turn it into ingots. Why didn't I not think of this before? I'm a numpty. Right. Let's go inside here. And then... Repair up all our tools. Put you in there. You're repaired. You're repaired. Repair the sword. And we'll repair that. Perfect. Everything is repaired. Good to go. Now, so, back to what I was saying before. We have managed to build most of the barn, as you can see. And it's looking pretty cool. It's not the most detailed thing in the world, but it serves a purpose. That's why it's here. The part we haven't finished is this bit. So, what we need to do now is we need to make sure that this bit is finished. So we're gonna dig out this little section here, like that. Let's remove this bit now. I need to do some repairing on this section because this bit is a little bit too high. Now this is going to be easy to fix because obviously we've got the nice lumber axe to help us do our job here. And with the lumber axe, life is easy. Put you in there, grab all the wood that we've got lying around. Okay, sweet. Now let's just dig out this section. Because we don't need this. Bam. So yeah, I've been really busy recently um, with work. And I've basically killed myself at work by doing all these hours that I've been doing. Um, life has kind of sucked a bit. Um, and I'm getting better with it. You know, dealing with things as they come. Take it one day at a time. As you can do. Because that is all you can do, really. When life knocks you down. 
get back up, get dealing with it, and just continue on. So, yeah, I have... I think I'm on day four of my holiday so far, and tomorrow's day five. So, tomorrow is the halfway point of my holiday, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna go and watch some movies at the cinema, and have some fun. But, for right now, we are making videos and playing Minecraft. So yeah, that's the plan for today. But one of the cool things is I've worked out a new way to get a better mod pack for uh, Matt's Palace. So for those of you that have been on the channel for a long time, you may remember that I used to do a series called Matt's Palace, which started off as Matt's uh, mansion and then grew into something bigger and better that I never planned on it being. Uh, so yeah, and I love, I love playing that. I played it in a very unique way. And I've got some awesome ideas that I've had since I stopped playing that I want to keep doing. But uh, I've not had a mod pack that has been stable enough to do it. Because the old mod pack I used to play on, it's a bit outdated. It's kind of falling apart and it lags like hell. So um, that's been annoying, to say the least. Uh, but obviously, we've just got to deal with it as we can. And take things and make new plans so that's what we're gonna be doing we're gonna be making new plans for it now i need to put a beam in here to make the roof line work so right let's go to sleep quickly before everything comes out and eats us alive there we are left the bed jump in bed boom we are asleep so yeah i'm gonna try and build a custom mod pack based off 1.12 with all the mods that i love playing like mechanism and stuff and start tinking around with the idea of Matt's Palace again. Um, that's my plan, anyway. For the moment. So let's just build ourselves a little staircase. Like this. So we can actually get on. No, don't do that. We don't want you to do that. There we are. And let's jump up here. Now, here we are. Perfecto. Uh, no, don't keep don't do that. Oh, so yeah, that's the plan for Matt's Palace. Otherwise, things on the channel are gonna go for normal. I'm trying to record as much as I can on the days that I've got left off for this holiday, as well as coming up with some ideas for new projects that I want to do. Because I've got a lot of projects that I want to do in the future and the coming months and that kind of thing. So we are definitely gonna try and do those. Um, but for now, we're just gonna work on what we've been doing here and see i guess what happens because at the moment i don't have enough time to do the projects that i've got in mind but i do have more holiday coming up in the future which will help with um being having finding time to do those projects so we have to wait until then and once i get there we can obviously start working on those projects so there's going to be some cool stuff coming up. And they're going to be like sort of art-themed stuff. Um, which is a bit different from what I normally do, obviously. But at the end of the day, it's going to be fun. And it's going to be awesome. So I'm definitely looking forward to doing that kind of stuff when it comes to it. Because it's going to be so much fun. Here we are. I made a boo-boo there. Right, bam, 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 and bam. And then what we need to do here is this. Turn you around and get this roof going. I hate building roofs. They are the longest and hardest part of any building project because they take forever. So much easier when you've got a flat roof, but then I think spawns on it and it's really annoying. Right, so, this is going to be the bit where we park or have all the horses, I guess. We want a couple of horses and a few animals to hang around with. Now, I was going to get lonely on this um, world. So, let's have a look. It would be so much easier if I could fly, but obviously that's not going to be a thing. Because there is no way to fly in this mod pack without using creative mode. But that's the thing, it's a mod pack. So we've got, you know... To deal with the situation at hand we have. Do you know what I might do, actually, is I might just build myself temporary scaffolding of dirt. Because dirt is the best scaffolding material there is. Right, that should help us quite a lot. 
So, in terms of what we've got here, I think that's about it for that. And then, because we're already over here, we can start bringing this across to meet up with the other side. So last night I went to got into bed and I was like, don't know what, I'm going to watch some Netflix and just chill out and while I fall asleep. So I ended up watching My Neighbor Totoro and I haven't seen that film in years. Oh my God, that film is so good. It's really weird and doesn't make a lot of sense a lot of times, but at the end of the day, it's a classic and it was fun. And then I fell asleep and woke up like 11 hours later thinking, what the hell happened last night? Oh wait, I watched Totoro. That's what I did. So... Yeah, woke up and I've been recording videos all day. We've recorded Batman so far today. We've done a bit of work on the barn and now we're recording Feed the Beast. So I will probably end up recording more stuff after this because that's what I tend to do sometimes. Sometimes you're in the mood to record videos and sometimes you're not. And when you are, I seem to do loads and loads of recording. Um, I haven't recorded Star Wars in a while, so I might go and record an episode of Star Wars after this. Because that might be fun. I do have a Borderlands episode pre-recorded that just needs editing. And it, I think over the next couple of days, if I can get at least two episodes of every series recorded, I might go back to doing a bit of Let's Build. Because I have got some footage for Let's Build pre-recorded and waiting to um, be added to and edited. Mind you... Let's, the Let's Build series is the longest series to record, edit, and all that kind of stuff because it takes so long. You have to edit everything to under the footage, and then you've got to go and uh, like record the voiceover for it. So it does take a long time to do anything with that series. But at the end of the day, that's my favorite series to probably record. Because you look back at it and go, damn, I've built that. And that is cool. Um, most definitely. So that is a big thing there. Now let's have a look at making some more steps. Because we do not have enough. At all. Boom. Is that going to be enough? It probably won't be. But. I'll tell you what, we'll leave it for a minute and see how far it gets us. It's not going to be enough at all, is it? I can guarantee that. Hold on a second, guys. I need to blow my nose. Right, I'm back. We're all good. Now. Out, what the heck? Come on, jump up. There we go. We've almost completed one side of the roof, which is good news for us. Oops. Just going to remove this one. So, yeah, I don't really know what the plan for this series is. I guess we're just going to build a super cool base. If you've got an idea of what our goal should be for a series, leave a comment down below and let me know because I have no ideas at the moment. Um, at all. So, ideas are really useful, obviously. Now, do I need to, I need to match this side, don't I? Oh, flip's sake. That was a bad idea, but do you know what? It's probably faster to do this than it is to just, uh, knock out a layer and then put it back in. Let's have a look. Boom. Boom. Come on. Boom. And boom. I've built this rather well. Not gonna lie. It seems to be the right length for what we're after to do. We've got 11. Oh, that's not gonna be enough, is it? But I do have a whole host of trees outside that I can knock down to uh, fill in the gaps. That I don't have, which we gotta need to go and do right now. Here we go. So, do you know what? 
I've always wanted to build a barn that's very similar to the one that's been in Smallville because I used to love watching Smallville when I was younger. So I kind of based this a little bit off the one from Smallville. It's nowhere near as cool as Clark Kent's, but it will do the job. Here we go. Ah, oh, look at that wood. It's flying down. Perfect. There we go. And now we should have plenty of wood to make more steps. As well as, let's get one more tree to finish off the beam. Great. There we are. Pick up the saplings that have dropped down at the moment. And get back to building. Right. Now, in terms of the steps, let's build some more. Boom. Boom. Ah, perfecto. Okay. I've not done too well here, have I? Got another set for. That should do it. Bam. Voila. We've got, should have enough for that. We've got another 16 of these bad boys. I think we're going to finish building the barn today. Hopefully. At least the roof and things. That's the main thing. Right, there we go. That's that done. Now, filling in the walls, easy part. Because we've got to do like this. Boom, 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 boom. Like so. I have missed playing Minecraft. Don't know what, I haven't even played Minecraft in weeks. I think the last time I played Minecraft was when I actually recorded the last episode of this, which was a while ago. That was a while ago. So yeah, let's just finish this wall off. Tell you what do, guys. I'm going to quickly jump off camera and finish the roof so that it's all done. And then I want to come straight back and we're going to finish things up. Let's go to bed first. Perfect. We have now finished the barn, guys. The barn is complete. At last. It is all finished. We're done. We can start filling it full of cool machines and other stuff. It is complete. Well, that's been a bit of a journey and a bit of like two hours wasted or more. But we have a bomb and we can start using it. Now, next episode, power is going to be a priority because we don't have much. Not at all. We don't have a lot. We also have this bad boy running away doing its thing. Um, it is incredibly slow because obviously the amount of power that we are producing is really, really bad. But... By the end of next episode, hopefully we can fix that problem and have a bit more power. Whether we build more of these bad boys, who knows? Or some solar panels. We'll see what we can do. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Please let me know what you think the goal for the series should be down below in the comments. Hi.